Well, I, I'm a watercolor painter and I've been painting for about, oh, almost 15 years. And I started with a, a teacher here in Hadley, um, Lou Curran, and um, I've been participating in, in a class um, with other watercolor painters. And um, the, the person I'm exhibiting with, Robin Levine, um, is also part of this group. So we've been painting together for quite a while. And um, we like to paint um, a lot from uh, the, the natural world. So we have a lot of flowers and I, I like to paint flowers. I like to paint um, landscapes. And um, I think my, my emphasis is a lot on um, color and color and shapes and, and just the atmosphere. Um, of the painting, so I'm, I'm interested in um, painting a lot in this area and a, a lot of the natural landscapes. So um, these are paintings that I have mostly done over the last two years and they are based on the nature that I've either seen or some of my paintings are a combination of something I've seen and then artistic license to use my imagination in creating the painting and some of them are places I travel most of them are from things that I see around the Pioneer Valley Well, I painted them over a period of time, and um, I think it, it's uh, more going out. And um, I like to I like to hike. I like to walk, um, and it's it's what strikes me as as I'm outside um, most of them. Um, a lot are, are flowers too from my garden. I like to garden. I love color, and I love being out in nature. And it's it's for me it's a way to capture as some people capture with a photograph, I try to capture with a painting. Basically, uh, watercolor is uh, it's a, it's a mixture of the water and the paint and the paper. And um, the thing about watercolor is it's um, very unpredictable. So sometimes you start off with a um, with an idea of what you want to paint, um, but the paint kind of does does its own thing when you put in uh, the amount of water, and uh, they're very unpredictable results. So um, it's basically mixing, you know, mixing paint and water and uh, seeing what happens. <laughs> And sometimes uh, you use very wet paint, sometimes you use dry paint. Um, there are a lot of uh, diff different techniques. Well, my process is varied. Sometimes I paint from a photograph, sometimes I paint from my memory, and sometimes I paint from my imagination. It's always watercolor, and sometimes it's on dry paper, sometimes it's on wet paper, and it's always tube paint as opposed to pan paint. All I can say is that this is, um, you know, it's nice to have the opportunity to display my paintings and um, this is a beautiful a beautiful location and they have a, a really nice um, display, pay, display place um, and a nice gallery so it's a, it's a great place to um, put paintings up. <laughs> no, I'm really appreciative of being able to display my art and have people come and enjoy it. <laughs>